Hey guys, just wanted to share um, my first banner that I created. Um, this is a banner that I use the Prima Romance Novel paper, and um, it's my first one. And I just, you know, use black chipboard. I'll show you guys what I did. It says artist. Um, I'll start with this one. The flower I just noticed I have to glue. Um, so anyways, these are some really pretty flowers that I made out of that vintage curtain that one of the ladies that I work for gave me, and I really like it. So I put it on here with some um, pearl trim, and I use this, you know, kind of jute trim for the whole thing to put it all together. Here I have a Tim Holtz memo pin with a just a, you know, something from the paper line, some burlap trim behind it, and then what I did, I distressed all the edges. Um, Started with the black cardstock, then I put some of the paper line, then a, another paper line, another piece of the paper that I popped out and distressed and put it on top. Here I just have some bling. And for the letters, I actually painted them with silver and a metallic gold kind of brownish. And I used some of this like diamond dust and I just stuck it on the paint and then it just dried right in there so it came out really good. It was kind of easy to um, do it that way without glue. Then I just have a stamp over here. So here's the first one and I did a little bow. And then here is, I'm just gonna take this off and I'll glue it later. Here's the R. This one I love, cause you know I love these. I just have some, um, a piece of crochet trim there. And these are really cool, the Prima light bulbs, cause anything you put behind them you could see. So it says create. And then I have some flowers here. Um, these are from uh, Craft Supplies 1, but I'm not sure if she carries these anymore, and I just kind of grunged it up with some paint. And then um, I have some pink Recollections trim here. Uh, bling, you know what I mean. <laughs> and then a Recollections gray flower. And here's the paper, and then another paper on top. And they are... And here's the tea with another one of those flowers that I made. Um, and then on the left side is another flower and some more um, bling trim. And then I used one of these um, things that you, one of these pieces that you cut out from the paper line and just distressed it all. And some burlap trim. So here's the T. Then I have the eye. And I used same, the flowers from Craft Supplies 1 here. And this is just from a pick at Michael's, you know, so here's some more trim and another flower in the eye. So I really like this. I hope you guys like it too. Let me know what you think. Um, it's my first banner and, or I guess you call it a banner or pennant banner. And I think I'll make some more because it was a lot of fun. Um, here's the S and another flower um, and then some more craft supplies one over here. And this is inspired, and then an S with the bling, and then, you know, the paper. And here's the T, and these are from Craft Supplies 1 as well. And then, um, you know, I just curled the ends. I just used my paintbrush for that. I don't have a special tool. And then another um, piece that I cut out, some more bling, and another Recollections flower. So then a little bow. So then, you know, it'll hang up really pretty. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Let me know what you think. Um, and make sure and check out Craft Supplies 1 on Zibit. Sorry, I'm trying to put it all together. Um, okay. <laughs> so let me know what you guys think. And have a great day. Bye.